Yeah, what up, guys? Um, sorry, it's a bit back. Um, just at home. How's it going? You can tell me where I I know it's a bit too long. Which, knowing me, I'll get the products off my hairdressers. Um, I've got just to do it t shirt on. I'm in the middle of watching Ghost Hunters investigation. About that, I've got one coming up very soon. Um, what we in January? I've got one in April. Um, it's a ghost um, hunter. Hunting. It's a ghost hunting one over in Liverpool. Uh, it's so lost because I've been told about it. I'm gonna go on YouTube. Um, I'm just gonna have a chill out day today. Back in tomorrow. Um, and all that. Gotta check this. Um, this video out. I have been told about it. I'm gonna read up it. it, it it's called. Anyway, I'll tell you a bit later on actually. So I'll go and check it out. So hey guys, like I said, this is what I'm gonna say. Nation Park Hospital is a mental asylum hospital, and that's where I'm going in April. I'd love to show you some of the clips, but obviously doing my own vloggings, I'm not too sure if we can um, show other people's vloggings, I don't want to do any crap. Um, if you want to see it yourself, go and have a look, it's Newsham, Newsham Park Hospital. It was, it's a mental hospital, asylum hospital, but it was, I know it was something else as well, it's, it's abandoned now, and that's what I'm going to see in April, so I'm just, I've seen some of the clips, and um, so I'm just going to have a look a bit more, I've seen that I'm just going to look into more into it. Um, but yeah, go check it out. See what they're like. You never know. They do um, tours. Um, like different week. And you can book on. I don't know if you can see. That's the building. Right there. That's my new TV. So I'm just in the middle. Um, it was also back in the 1800s. It was also an orphanage for kids. Then they changed it to a mental home. So, uh, so I'm just going to look at different clips. Let's... So it's like I said, it's over in Liverpool. So it's over in Liverpool, um, as like we like to call it, Scouse Land. Um, I do apologise if I offend you for a bit. And that's what I'm going to see in April, at the end of April. So, obviously I'll do the bit of vlogging for it. But in the meantime, I'm just going to chill out. Do all the stuff. I'm gonna go a bit of shopping in a bit. So I'll see you on in a bit. Mm.
So I'm just saying, <clears throat> many of you don't know, I like me history, so just sat here watching the World War 2 in colour, don't know what it's like, I'm on, at the minute it's pretty interesting. Uh, what are we on? I'm on epi series one, episode four. At a minute, there's only one series. So I'm just watching it at a minute. It is, it's interesting. But Stalin, elated by the Red Army's success, now demanded a massive really is interesting. Especially if you like your history like this. And he wanted to know what's gone on, what he was like back then. This, this is ideal. For the next four months, fighting swirled inconclusively around the German defensive positions. For Hitler, this was a very uncomfortable situation. Whether or not this is copyright, I don't know, but hey, no. Ask me if I'm bothered. Now he was dangerously bogged down in the Soviet Union and facing an enemy that never seemed to give up. There's the munchkin getting bigger. Nor was Russia his only hero. Probably two. Uh, on December the seventh, nineteen forty-one, Allied Japan candles on. attacked the United States without war. Smart me, yeah. Hitler, with almost no thought, also declared war on the U.S. With no advanced planning, he had taken on a massive new enemy. <laughs> As 1941 became 1942, Hitler remained determined to go on the offensive again in Russia. But he needed a new strategy. The original plan of fighting across the whole front was no longer there. Alright guys, so I just got back from a bit of shopping. Went to best and better. This is what we got. That's the two bags. That's how good they are. Yeah, that thickness. I've got a bit of sausage. There. Uh, broken black pudding. So we just give you a bit of a bite. Right, let's have a look at that. A bit of salt and pepper chicken there. Tell you what, these are the best shop going. Got me Christmas shop with a girl in there. Look at that. All that. I'm going to sort of put in. Bit of bacon. I'm going to use it. Ten to do five each. That's not all. Do you see it? Then? I'm going to see it. Anyway, anyway, so I just got back from mm -hmm. Best in Better. Oh. Bit of this. Oh. Mine, ignore the eyes because yeah. I got them from another shop. So that's that. That will kill them tricky. Mm -hmm. Fancy Chinese, no? They've done it for. Yeah, do that with two. So. Just done that. These are the rest. All that in there. Look at them burgers. Ignore the wife. Someone's got you. Right. So there's two, two and three. Yeah. Why did you message your back? 
So it's what are you paying for tea tomorrow night, Daniel? I'll cheat it out. We'll get that for a whole chicken. Get that out in a minute. And to be honest with you guys, these ain't sninji either. As well. So you can imagine what it's like. What chicken are these, do you? Garlic, I think. I don't know, but that's not fucking fair. You've done half and half? I've not just any of it yet. No, I mean. I'm not. I didn't say. I just got in the chat. I just got the Chinese, and that was it. Well, they're the Chinese. So anyway, guys, I'll show you a bit later on. Peekaboo. Anyway guys, I've just had with tea. Um tried the sausages and black pudding. I've had them before. Um but I've never had a like this. Bang on. Um the the I had chicken wings with it. Then I absolutely die for um Dead juice, uh, I've had them in the, I've had them before, but these are dead juice, uh, they're not in your face, really, really nice, um, I'll post it in the website, I'll post his website in the description for you, so go and have a look, check him out on Facebook, he's, um, he's called Best and Better, go and check him out, he does one of the best meats you would ever have mounted. And he's not a ninja, he does really good portions <coughs> and all that. Go and check him out. Anyway, I'm gonna wrap it up for tonight, lads. But guys, um, I'll see you next time.